Hello everyone, welcome to Corn Flower Crafts. I'm Corn, and today I have a project share. Um, the last video I posted, we were up in the craft room together and I was making the body of one of the gnomes, which when she makes an appearance, I will remind you of that that's our girl. And then yesterday, I brought the camera back in the craft room to do some decorating on the gnomes together and some braiding and some hairdos, I guess, <laughs> and the video failed. So, without further ado, these little ones want to walk the pink carpet. And first we have Samuel. Okay, Sam, you're up. Mm-hmm, yep. He's working it. No. And Samuel is sporting a pink beard. And as you see, it's a little bit scruffy. <laughs> um, the faux fur comes from Joanne Fabrics, and I just love the pale pink. He wanted it uh, dyed for Valentine's Day. He said, put all the hearts I want on them. So he actually has red and pink hearts around him. He has the ribbon that says love, 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 love around his base. He has this ribbon as his sash or tie around his tunic. And then he's sporting, yes, a little pink pom-pom from Hobby Bobby on the tip of his hat. And then die cut, die cut, die cut for his hearts. And then this is a little foam, glittered foam heart that comes from Walmart a couple of years ago okay and he said he just wanted to be all about love oh speaking of love who are those guys um this is jonathan hi jonathan i'm sorry i didn't introduce you right away and then this is fred and fred wanted to make an appearance to say hello to Karamia and her family and then jonathan wanted to say how you doing girl to Mimi <laughs> no I know that's not very we have discussions with being respectful to women mm-hmm okay now Samuel we're gonna put you right there okay now next we have Gunther and Gunther Yes, he said, I'm farmhouse, and he says, I'm very macho, <laughs> and he wanted to just, he wanted a double sash, so he, he said, double farmhouse, I was like, okay, he said, I don't want super fancy, because that's not who I am, but he did allow me to do a die cut out of the black and white check. Uh, felt that I got from Joanne Fabrics and he also allowed me to put this is another glittered foam heart from Walmart and he said the glitter's fine just nothing else though <laughs> so yes he says you can show me okay so we're gonna put him here and next we have Marguerite Marguerite. Oh, yeah, she's going to walk it. Mm-hmm. 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 Yes, that's good. Okay. And she is sporting. She said she doesn't care if her hat is recycled from a baby blanket from Dollar Tree. She owns it. She thinks it's darling for Valentine's because it's nothing but hearts. She said she didn't have to stay with the traditional colors but she did have me try to cover up as best I could this uh, more peachy colored heart because she said, and I quote, that's just too much. <laughs> and she is sporting um, magenta trim on her skirt. The fabric for her skirt matches, as you see, her hat perfectly. I was real happy. Um, this comes from Amazon. And they sell, I've had it for months, they sell 
a bundle of, squ of large squares. And I'm pretty sure it's, and they're all cotton for, you know, quilting. But I wanted them for um, paper crafting and, well, all crafting. So die cut for the heart with a little scallop. I love a scallop heart. These little goodies come, the pearl bows come from Amazon. This little heart, that's really, she said she needed some bling that was cut in a way that it was really saying hello. And when it hits the sun, it's mostly the colors in the, in the hat, which I think is kind of sweet. She did want um, flowers on her somewhere. She said hearts and flowers, you know, hello Valentine's. <laughs> and then this little ribbon uh, flower I made the same to pull your eyes up this way and then a flat back pearl there. And that flat back pearl comes from Joann's as well when they did have a Miss Sparkle and Cub. So that's how she turned out. And a little heart in the back of her hat as well. Oh, sorry, Jonathan, we won't block Mimi's view. And then last but not least, we have Wendy. And Wendy. Yes, well, there's still some room. Yeah, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. you got room. And this is Wendy, and she is, you could, did you, do you see why I call her Wendy with her red braids? <laughs> um, there's a very famous uh, eating establishment, and um, when we were working together, uh, I said, oh my goodness, you remind me so much of a, of a, um, a young lady that an eating establishment, an eating establishment was named after, because when she was a little girl, she used to sport her red braids, and she said, "Well, my name is Wendeline." <laughs> I said, "Wendeline, isn't that like Windex or something?" She said, "Excuse me." I was like, "I beg your pardon," and she said, "Talk about respect." You're right. You're right, and. Um, so she said, but she's called Wendy. So I thought, oh, that's cool. And she's sporting some, her little bows on her braids. That ribbon comes from Martha Stewart. Remember when Tuesday morning had the wonderful Martha Stewart stuff for a while? And that was years ago. I held on to it because I love Martha Stewart stuff. <laughs> and then she has teeny tiny heart bling in the center of those. Then she's sporting a little white apron with a pink pocket, and then the pocket is decorated with um, a die-cut heart, and then um, some more. This little trim, I cut this uh, trim from Hobby Lobby. This ribbon rose comes from a thrift store, and then this is another one of the foam hearts, and then I put some bling, heart bling in the middle, and then this is another of the scalloped heart uh, die cuts. And then inside, as you see, she has a paper that says hugs and kisses, one that says deliver by February 14th, and then the other one says love. And I need to tell you all, if you are, are ones that that purchased this, um, the satiny ribbon from Hobby Lobby a few years back, and if you've ever tied it and then retied it, I had it in a bow. Um, this was on that video as well. Um, they came off. These come off. So I had already made the apron. So I couldn't take it, you know, the, it off the top of the apron. So I ended up re-gluing the little hearts on that came off. So just to warn you, um, bows aren't as much fun in this ribbon. <laughs> and then we'll put Wendy right here. Um, okay, Jonathan said, can he still be seen? Not Jonathan, um, Fred. Let's see, guys. Let's put the girls closer together. Okay. 
You guys can be seen as well. <laughs> and then, therefore, we'll just move everybody in. How about that? There we go. Even more so. Okay. Jonathan said, not too close. <laughs> he really wants that date with me, man. I'm not, I'm not kidding. And I'd like to thank you all so much for joining me today. And I hope you have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening. Bye-bye, everybody. Take good care.